All right, good morning, good morning, everybody. Good morning. Welcome, welcome, Periscope. Welcome, Scopers. And welcome, Meerkatters, I guess you call them. Meerkatters, all right. <laughs> we got the Scopers together with the Meerkatters. All right, all right. Daryl Muhammad here, real estate investor, mentor, coach, trainer, entrepreneur, online, offline sales and marketing specialist, professional. Been out here grinding since 1990 after graduating from Texas Southern University. All right, let me know where you're coming from. Give me your name, what city you're coming from over there at Periscope and welcome, welcome to the Mayor Catters. Let me know where you're coming from. This is Daryl Muhammad. Thank you, Sister Candice for inviting and sharing. You want to, if you're on Periscope, swipe to the right, share Facebook and on Twitter. And also make sure you follow me because these are impromptu trainings, okay? Impromptu trainings. Okay, welcome to everybody on Meerkat. Let me know who you are and where you're coming in from. Just go ahead and send me a message on the screen. Let me know who you are and where you're coming in from, all right? Give me your name. Give me your name. All right, we're going to get started here in a few more minutes, ladies and gentlemen. As with all my scopes, uh, don't want to be long. Do want to be strong, but don't want to be long, okay? All right, we want to keep these under 30 minutes. Keep them under 30 minutes uh, so I can focus on bringing you content. And if you have any questions, just save those for the end so we can dismiss uh, those that have to leave, have to go. Uh, and do something else. All right. Welcome, everybody. Good morning. I'm here in Houston, Texas, and it's about 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock Central Standard Time here in Houston. Uh, well, alaikum salam, Sister Denise. Welcome, welcome. You've been doing a great job on your periscope, Sister. Keep it up. Keep it up. Uh, so we're doing these as, as a pre-launch, all right, ladies and gentlemen, as a pre-launch to my up-and-coming real estate course, The Secrets to Wholesaling Real Estate volume one and two. Um, so we're going to make that available to you uh, here pretty soon. But we want to give you content, 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 and more content. Over there on Periscope, you're looking at my homepage there. And you get to my homepage by going to thesecretstowholesaling.com. Thesecretstowholesaling.com. You want to get on as many relative uh, lists, relevant, I'm sorry, relevant lists as possible. Okay, whatever your space is uh, that you're concentrating on, you want to grow in, you want to develop in real estate, uh, investments, uh, personal development, health and fitness. You want to find folks that have bodies of information that you don't have that you can use. All right. That's what it's all about. And you want to get on their list. All right. You want to subscribe to the list. So if you go to the secrets to wholesaling dot com and get on my list. Just subscribe there. That'll be the list. And uh, we'll release some information there that you're not going to get anywhere else exclusive to folks on my list. Okay, on my list. So uh, welcome. Once again, Periscope, you swipe and share, please. Everybody that's watching right now on Periscope, share it with Facebook, your Facebook friends and your Twitter friends. And make sure you follow me as well. Okay. All right. So today we're going to talk about the number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal. The number one enemy. Thank you, Sister Denise, for sharing. Thank you so very much. Invited some followers. Thank you so very much. I appreciate the love. And hit the screen over there at Periscope. Give me some hearts that will let me know and let Periscope know that you're enjoying this broadcast. So let's go ahead and turn this baby around. All right. There I am for everybody on Periscope. All right. So that's what we want to cover, ladies and gentlemen. We want to cover the number one enemy. All right. The number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal. The number one enemy. That's so very important because if, if, if you're a farmer, you need to know what your enemies are to your crops. You just can't know, you know, how to plant, how to cultivate, you know, how great it's going to be once once your harvest comes and, and how much food you're going to be able to produce and feed people in the month, you know, amount, the, the amount of money you're going to make. 
What's going to make the difference is knowing your enemies, knowing what's going to be a threat to your harvest. All right. So you need to know what's going to be a threat to your first wholesale real estate deal. See, one thing about me and the way I help my students and my course is going to cover it. I'm going to talk about towards the end is I give you the good, the bad and the ugly. All right. I'm not trying to make a million dollars off selling courses. You want to know why I'm selling courses? Do you want to know why? Let me know if you want to know why and I'll tell you. Okay, if you don't want to know why, then then you know, don't ask. But if you want to know why, I'll tell you. All right? So in Periscope, if you want to know why, send me a message. Let me know. But you have to know who you, what your enemy is. You have to know what your number one enemy is. All right? In real estate and making your first wholesale deal. All right, I guess... Sister Cassandra uh, Candace, I'm sorry, is the only one. All right, Sister Denise. All right, the reason why is because I want to help as many people as I can. You know, people have helped me get to where I have gotten the things that I've accomplished. I'm not self-made. I never say I'm self-made because I don't know, you know, who's self-made, okay? But here's the thing that we need to understand, we need to realize is that people are going to help us along the way. And if we're constantly trying to advance and get better, we're going to constantly need help. All right. So I want to help people. All right. Not make money off the course. I want to help people. But number two is I'm looking to partner with the best of my students. All right. You're always going to have those that rise to the cream of the crop. That's going to rise to the top. Cream always rises to the top. Okay. So I'm looking for those students that's going to take my information, be an A student, run with it, and then make the money, and then we can partner on bigger deals. All right? We can partner and grow together. So that's the reason for the course. All right? If you're just joining me, my name is Daryl Muhammad, real estate investor, trainer, mentor, coach. Want to help you get started in real estate as a real estate wholesaler. All right? As a real estate wholesaler. All right. I'm an entrepreneur, uh, online, offline sales and marketing uh, professional or specialist, if you will. All right. Network marketer, networking. Those things are that are, are paramount to being a successful entrepreneur, real estate investor. All right. And I'm here to help you. I'm here to help those who want to help themselves. I'm here to help those that understand their value and understand they have to invest in themselves continuously. All right. In order to achieve their goals. And I'm looking for those individuals that are going to take full responsibility for their success. All right. So if that's you. Make sure you reach out to me because I'm looking for those kind of people. And if you're one, then I want to connect with you. All right. So we're talking about today the number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal. I'm going to go into another uh, 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 Meerkat and, and Scopes. Uh, why I'm so adamant about real estate and I really feel blessed and fortunate to start off in the wholesaling area of real estate investing, okay? The wholesaling area of real estate investing, okay? Because I think that's where every person should start that's a newbie, all right? Every person should start as a newbie in wholesale real estate. See, so the number one reason why or the number one enemy to your first real estate wholesale deal. I'm going to tell you that in a minute. All right. Make sure you have your pen and papers ready so you can write it down. All right. These scopes and, and Meerkat broadcasts that I put together, ladies and gentlemen, is not for entertainment. I will start having some of those lifestyle, more entertainment type of uh, uh, broadcasts, if you will, or live streams. But right now we're focusing on the pre-launch of my real estate course, The Secrets to Wholesaling Real Estate, Volume 1 and 2, The Good, The Bad, and The Ugly, How to Make $5,000 with No Risk, No Money, and No Credit, all right? Legally, ethically, ethically, and morally, right? So go to thesecretstowholesaling.com, thesecretstowholesaling.com, and get on my list, all right? So let's get ready, because I want to expound on them. We want to uh, conclude this in a matter of about 10 or 15 minutes. Because we're in the middle of the day and you have things to do. All right. Now, here's what we're going to talk about. The number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal and how to uh, avoid them. All right. How to avoid it. It's only one. 
but it's so huge. It's so big. It's stopping most people in their tracks. All right. It's disguised. It's a wolf in sheep clothing. It's disguised in a lot of different ways, ladies and gentlemen. But from my experience and my personal sojourner, if you will, in life and real estate investing, once you peel back those layers, once you peel back those layers, ladies and gentlemen, the number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal. And if you can overcome this or when you overcome this, You'll be on your way, but it's a continuous process. You're going to have to continue to over overcome it, right? Because there's different monsters along the way, right? There's different monsters on the road that you're going to travel to your financial goals, all right? So, so they're going to show up. They're going to constantly uh, pop up. But as you and I defeat this enemy, this same enemy that pops up, it becomes smaller and smaller and smaller, right? Right now, it's a big enemy. Right now, you, you don't know what to do. And that's what I'm here to tell you, how to avoid it, what to do. And how to avoid it is not really a good term. It's how to deal with it. You don't want to avoid it, right? You want to deal with it, all right? But you might avoid it by dealing with it. So what is that one thing that's big right now, but it's going to get smaller, right? As we develop courage, as we develop strength, as we develop the mindset of understanding what it is that I'm looking at and how to overcome it. All right. And how to overcome it, not avoid it, overcome it. So what is that one thing, Daryl? What is that one thing you're holding back on me? You're holding out on me. I got to go. So I need to take it and run with it. Well, don't, don't, you know, one of my mentors said over at Organo Gold, Holt and Bug say, sometimes you got to slow down to speed up. Did you get that? Did anybody get that? Did you get that over there, Meerkat? Send me a little message let me know you got it. Did you get that at Periscope? Show me some hearts. Send me a message let me know that you got it. Sometimes you have to slow down to speed up. Slow down to speed up. So let's slow down right now so you can speed up after you get the information then you speed up, all right? Got it? All right, so here's the number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal and how to overcome it. The number one enemy is, you ready? Fear. Fear. It's disguised in a lot of nicer terms, more politically correct language, but ladies and gentlemen, if there's anything that has been the biggest issue, the biggest obstacle, the biggest problem in my life, when I peeled that onion back and finished crying from the strength of the onion, it was fear. Fear. False evidence appearing real. Fear. See, so we have to, we have to understand that it's fear. It's not that I'm too busy. It's not that I have, I don't have any money. It's not that I work all the time. It's not that I'm always busy with my children. It's not that I, I need to talk to my husband, my wife, or somebody else. It's fear. Fear. Fear of what happened if it doesn't work. Fear of what happened if I invest my money in your course, Daryl, and it doesn't work. Fear. Fear. That's the thing. What happened if I if I tell all my friends because you tell me to tell all your friends and let everybody know that I'm a real estate investor and and they and this is not my first attempt at real estate. It's not my first attempt at entrepreneurship. I tried that network marketing things five times and went to my family five different times. I, I'm just so embarrassed. I have egg all over my face, Daryl. That doesn't seem to stop dripping. It doesn't seem to dry up. I can't wash it off. I'm too embarrassed. Well, welcome to the club, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> That's what's required to be successful. We have to do what other people are not willing to do. And we have to press through those things that other people stop at. All right? Stop at fear. False evidence of appearing real. You heard that before, I'm sure. But here, we need to get a deeper understanding of fear. And it wasn't until I got a little deeper understanding of fear 
that can I, I can address the fear. Fear is a very unique thing. It doesn't occupy, it doesn't have weight, but it occupies space. Fear doesn't weigh anything. This case right here weighs more than fear. But fear occupies space. If your head is consumed with fear, meaning your entire consciousness is full of fear, you're sweating, your heart's beating, you know, because something's about to happen, you're anticipating that something's about to happen. Even if you see a, a pit bull coming towards you growling, he hasn't bit you yet. Right? He hasn't bit you yet. He might not bite you. But you're already at that point. Right? You already imagine in your mind, this pet bull is going to jump in my throat, lock down, never let go, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to die. See, it's false evidence. Evidence. You don't have any proof. But it appears real. Let me tell you what I've learned from reading the many books that I've, I, I've read. Your mind, the power of your mind. Do you know, ladies and gentlemen, your mind cannot distinguish what's real and what's false? That's why affirmations are so powerful. Right? Your mind cannot distinguish what's real and what's false. That's why if you go to a movie theater and you watch a scary movie, that's why you jump when something happens. You know you're in a theater. You know you're looking at a screen. You know nothing's going to jump out of the screen, but you jump. Your heart flitters, right? You fall in love with a nice love scene. They're so, they're so in love with you, each other. They're staring each other in the eyes, and you, and you just feel warm. Your mind knows that's not you. Your mind knows that you probably might not have ever experienced that ever before in your life. But it doesn't stop your mind from believing it. Believing it. So fear is false evidence appearing real, ladies and gentlemen. And we bring that everywhere we go. And here's another nugget. It appears most oft times. And it appears the largest based on the unknown based on the unknown all right so fear so we have this fear about what's going to happen to this real estate deal we have this fear on what's going to happen if, 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 if i can't do the deal we have this fear of what's going to happen if i can't find an investor we, go, we have this fear about what's going to happen if if i can't find a t title company we have this fear no evidence just imaginary fear that something's going to go wrong, that something's not going to go right. That's why I like real estate wholesaling so much, because the risk is literally zero. It's literally zero, ladies and gentlemen. What business can you get into with zero, near to zero risk? Your job has more risk than wholesaling. So it only makes sense to me. Why, why wouldn't you do it? We understand real estate has the concept of wholesaling has no risk. But then we take all our monies and go a traditional route because it's sexier. I can put my chest out and say, uh, you know, I have my own uh, shop right down here around the corner. But you're coming out of your pocket every month. You're not working out the humble space in your home like I am here. Right. So fear, ladies and gentlemen, don't let fear stop you. Fear. What's going to happen if, the, if, if, if everything you imagine happens in the real estate transaction? What's going to happen to you? See, that's the question. Are you going to go to jail? I mentioned this in my in one of my previous periscopes. I'm trying to get my camera right. One of my previous periscopes that I learned back in the early 80s when I first started studying real estate investing. It was called creative financing back then. OK. But the guy said what he said, there's no jails for individuals who real estate deals don't go through. He said, they're not going to come and arrest you because you couldn't find the financing. They're not going to come and arrest you because you've never found the investor. They're not going to come and arrest you because, you know, you couldn't perform on the contract on the contract that you signed. 
They're not going to come and arrest you for that. Right? So what's the fear when it comes to wholesaling? What is the fear? It's even more imaginable. Right? Don't be a slave to your fears. Be the master of your fears. Master your fears. Okay? That's why I'm pre-launching with a very special price. If you want to get it now, don't hesitate, ladies and gentlemen, because you're hesitating because of fear. Let me tell you something. Money you can always get back. The opportunity and the time you can never get back the time. The opportunity, don't bet on it. See, now you're betting that you'll get another shot at it. Right? So if you want to get this course right now, I'll sneak you, sneak you a copy right now. I'll down, send you an email with the downloadable audios. Go to thesecretstowholesaling.com slash forward slash index one dot html. The secrets to wholesaling.com slash index one dot html. And I'll send that to you here in the next hour. All right? If you're serious, you'll be doing that right now. This is a replay. You'll get it on the replay. If you're serious, you'll go to your computer right now, your tablet or laptop, and you'll take care of that right now, ladies and gentlemen. All right? Everybody's looking for action takers. Everybody's looking for those individuals that understand the value, the true value of money. The true value of money, ladies and gentlemen, is not holding on to it. The true value of money is when you let it go and get something in exchange for it that's more valuable than the dollar itself. It's more valuable than the $5,000. It's more valuable than the $50,000. We're talking about real estate. We're talking about fear that's holding you back. The number one enemy enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal is fear and how to overcome it. What are you afraid of? You're afraid of what your husband's going to say? You done bought another one of these? How many times you, 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 you just fantasize too much about this real estate and fantasize too much about being rich? I'm tired of it. I told you if you bought another course, you and I were going to have some problems. Is that what we're afraid of? The ridicule of our Spouse, significant others, our friends. If that's the case, ladies and gentlemen, we have just disqualified ourselves. Daryl didn't disqualify you. We've disqualified ourselves from the thing that we want. The thing that we want. Fear. Don't let it fear. It don't, ladies and gentlemen, if it doesn't kill, kill you or severely hurt you. If it doesn't kill you or severely hurt you hurt you, take the chance. You always get some money back. Take the chance. $100, I mean, what can you buy with $100? You know what you can buy with $100? You can buy with $100 buys. <laughs> at the Michael Kors purse, at the Michael Kors shop, it might not buy as much as at Walmart. But $100 buys, $500 buys, ladies and gentlemen, what $100 or $500 buys? Whatever it buys, that's what it buys. It's not good, it's not bad, it just buys what it buys, all right? If you're just joining me, my name is Daryl Muhammad, real estate investor, coach, trainer, mentor, here to help you, here to help you get where I am and beyond, all right? To get where I am, I'm here. You can reach me at Daryl Muhammad, Periscope, follow me there, at Daryl Muhammad, Twitter at Daryl Muhammad, or my fan page at Facebook, Daryl Muhammad fan page, that's where you can go. All right? Ladies and gentlemen, at the scope slide, share at Twitter and Facebook. Twitter and Facebook. You, 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 don't, you can't limit the number of times you share. So share it. Every time you hear a nugget, share it. Every time you hear a nugget, hit some screens. Hit your screen. Give me some hearts. You know what? You know, those of us that go to church, right? That's your amen. That's your preach hard, reverend. That's what we have to do. All right? Because I can't hear you. You can hear me. Okay? We're approaching that time. So fear we're talking about. The number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal, ladies and gentlemen, is fear. Don't let fear stop you. Fear to successful people, highly successful people, punk is a fear to them. Fear is a punk to them, I should say. 
They look at fear and call them bad names. They look at their fears and say, you punk, I'm going to overcome you. You were just like your brother I saw last week. And I kicked his butt. I'm going to kick your butt. Your butt is next. Fear. Fear of what someone's going to say. Fear of the unknown. That's the big, that's the boogie monster. You know, you're growing up. You know, some of us grew up and we were told about the boogie monster. Always lurking in the dark. Always lurking in, the, in, 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 in places unseen. The boogie monsters. Here we are. Grown people. I'm 50. About to be 51. And I still got boogie, <laughs> boogie monsters. <laughs> still got a boogie man. Fear is a boogeyman. <laughs> and we have to say, like our Christian family says, stop telling God how big your problem is and start telling your problem how big your God is. Tell that fear, that fear, you are a punk and I'm going to overcome you. All right? So don't let those things stop you, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to help you with that. I'm here to coach you through that. I'm here to give you the muscle, the motivation on how to deal with it. Okay? That's what I'm here to do. That's what I'm here to do. So fear. Now, how do you overcome fear, Daryl? Well, how do people overcome fear of rattlesnakes, snake handlers? How does the tiger or lion trainer overcome the fear of of working with an animal that at a swipe of a paw can rip their face apart. Right? How do they overcome that? They overcome that because the, 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 the cat, the tiger, the lion is so cute as a cub. They overcome that by, by, by talking sweet to the lion and the cub? I don't think so. Matter of fact, I, I, know, I know that's not the case. How they do it, ladies and gentlemen, is the same way we are going to overcome the boogeyman, the boogie monster called fear. Not even calling it names, not even calling it a punk. Right? If fear lives in between six inches of real estate called your mind, then we overcome it at the same place we find it in our minds. You do that by getting specific knowledge in reference to that very thing that you fear. A lion tamer cannot learn about how to handle snakes specifically, rattlesnakes, right? And use that exactly to apply to tigers. Principle, yes. Exactly apply to tigers, no. Right? You can't sneak up behind the tiger and grab it behind the neck, right? Like you would a snake so it won't curl around and bite you. Right? Can't do that. So in order to do that, ladies and gentlemen, you have to get specific knowledge of that specific thing that's causing the fear. That's causing the fear. Wow, man, I don't know if I should buy Daryl's course. Man, it's, it's a lot of money, and, and I've spent, uh, I, I spent already thousands of dollars. I went to Robert Kiyosaki's. I went to, I went to, I went to uh, uh, you know, uh, Robert Allen. That's going back some ways on you guys. But anyway, I've gone to Nick Viducci's, and I've gone to to Yancey's, I've gone to uh, Than Merrill's, I, I've gone to, to all these courses and spent my money and, and, and I, I'm just, I'm, I'm afraid that I'm just wasting my money. Well, I'm here, ladies and gentlemen, I'm not those gurus that you can't reach, right? Tweet me, inbox me at Facebook, we'll get on the call and I'll, I won't sell you, but I'll sell you. I'll sell you on you. I won't sell you on my course. I'll sell you on you. Why you are worthy to invest in yourself all the time and every time. All the time and every time. Always bet on you. Because no one else should bet on you if you're not willing to bet on yourself every time. Not sometimes. Not when I have money. Not when I feel like it. Not after work. But every time. Okay? So that's what that's about. So how do you do that, Daryl? How do you overcome fear? You got to get the specific knowledge. Specific knowledge will help you to overcome the fear. They learn specific knowledge of the nature of the rattlesnake. When does it attack? How does it attack? What it looks like prior to attacking. 
right? And what to do if it does bite you? <laughs> so what to do if something does go wrong on a real estate deal? What to do if I if I if, 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 if I don't have time to study? What can I do so it won't be detrimental to my health, my financial health, my health of, of my time frame condition? Get specific knowledge of wholesale and real estate, ladies and gentlemen. Get specific knowledge of whatever it is, health, fitness, financial, personal finances, your credit. Get specific knowledge. Invest in yourself in those areas of specific knowledge. Specific knowledge pays the most. A general practitioner in medicine doesn't make as much as a foot doctor or a heart doctor or a lung doctor or a, a, a kidney or liver doctor. Thank you for the hearts, Candace. Thank you very much. All right? Candace is getting a lot out of this program. If I can just reach one in my pursuit of reaching many, then that's, that's worth my time. Hopefully it's worth yours. All right, Meerkatters, I hope you're enjoying this. I see I got some comments from Alexis. Thank you very much, Alexis. Do I scope and stream simultaneously? I'm doing that right now. Yes, I do. Right? Repurpose. Killing two birds with one stone, so to speak. And there's two different markets, all right? Does McDonald advertise on TV and the radio on the same day? Yes, they do. All right? So, um, so get specific knowledge, ladies and gentlemen. I want to encourage you to get my real estate course. All right? I'm going to do some training. Hopefully, I'm going to start this week. But I'm going to just see how these preliminary trainings go. All right? But here's what you need to do. You need to go to thesecretstowholesaling.com and sign up to stay in contact with me. All right? You need to follow me on Periscope and Twitter. You need to go to my Facebook fan page, Daryl Muhammad fan page. Stay connected. Those are called social media platforms so we can connect and socialize with each other. All right? This is going to come out real soon. 13 hours. No holes barred. Boot camp. Camp style. The good, the bad, and the ugly of wholesaling. All right? What you don't learn and haven't learned in any other wholesale course is, is, is in this one. All right? But I'm going to give you an opportunity to get it right now and all the way up to the launch. If you want to get it right now, go to secretstowholesaling.com forward slash index one dot html. All right? So get the specific knowledge, ladies and gentlemen. And get with someone that's going to tell you the good, the bad, and the ugly. If they only tell you about all the good things that's going to happen, you know, then you need to ask about what's the worst that's going to happen. All right, human nature is as such what people do not lead with the negative. You know, I'm not going to meet you and you're not going to meet me. And I hope you don't tell me what's wrong with the world and what's wrong with your life and how you're not a perfect person when we just met. Because I'm definitely not going to do that with you. Okay, so you don't expect somebody not to start off with the best part. As James Brown said, get on the good foot. But I get on, I start on the good foot. I stay on the good foot and I let you know the real deal. I keep it 100 with you. All right. And most people are not going to do that because they're too busy trying to sell you the course. And you are going to lose some people by telling them the ugly part. All right. But I'm not going to do that because I'm not here to sell courses. I'm here to sell courses and find key students to partner with for major deals, apartment complexes, etc. All right? I'm here to help you change your financial life in the midst of what's surrounding us economically here in America. You need to do something drastically different. We need to do something tra tra uh, drastically different. If you believe in social security, then um, you might want to look at the facts, right? Specific knowledge about your situation. Specific knowledge about those things that, are, that you're depending on. It's going to affect your life, right? So we talked about fear. The number one enemy to your first wholesale real estate deal is fear. False evidence of appearing real. It occupies space, but it has no weight. Okay? It has no weight, but it occupies space. And it's based on the unknown. Fear is the boogeyman and boogie monster that's stopping you from your first deal. And ask the question, what if it all goes wrong? Can I live with it? 
Will it kill me? Was it, will, will it cause severe pain or injury? If not, move forward. We talked about slowing down and speeding up. Slow down, get the information, then you take off and run with it. All right? Like your pants on fire. All right, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Daryl Muhammad, real estate investor, coach, mentor, trainer, here to help you get started in wholesale real estate because it can and will change your life like it has done for me and my family. And I'll tell you about that story uh, hopefully next time or here in a few in the near future. So stay tuned. Make, your, make sure you follow me on Periscope and Twitter at Daryl Muhammad, D-A-R-R-E-L-L. M-U-H-A-M-M-A-D, like Muhammad Ali, the boxer, all right? And you can also find me on Facebook, Daryl Muhammad fan page, all right? Or go to my website, thesecretstowholesaling.com, and get on the list. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for your time. And as I always say, see you at the top, not from the top, all right? Meerkat, see you later. Periscope, Stampy, Candace, I'm going to answer your question. Thank you.